Matt Cernsey down here at Annie Mae Phillips Stadium with the Hawthorne Sports Network with a post-game interview brought to you by ESAL. Here with the big man himself that's anchoring that offensive line at center, Tyler Duncan. Tyler, senior, two games in a row here at home. Nail biters, what's your thoughts going into these games and the emotion that's all around these? Uh, going into these games, I try to I try to anchor down and focus on protecting the QB, especially this game with us having the freshman QB, Roundtree. He did great. He, I, I can't even explain how good he did stepping up and filling in the spot for Adrian. How about also against this big 6A team be able to put together a ground game and to see y'all as an offensive line unit just take Keenan on, on your back and be able to create those holes for him? So with the run game, we, we, just, got, we just came in knowing – if, if pass isn't going to work out, we practice all week, sled on and off, just going, run game, run game, run game. And we, we knew it's going to be, it's going to have to be a hard fought game. This is your first year being part of this program. What's it like coming here? You have a lot of family ties to the program. What's it like being here in Hawthorne and playing with this group of guys? It's a great, it's a great feeling. I, I, I can't explain it knowing that just my, my heritage here. And my back, my background is from here, and just seeing, just thinking about how my grandfather and my my uncle and all them were playing here, right where I'm standing, it's just great. Hornet fans, that is Tyler Duncan, senior center, the anchor of the offensive line, here as Hawthorne comes away with a victory, 27-21, in front of a packed crowd at Anime Phillips Stadium. I'm Matt Cernsey with ESAL. Great job.